Hey Taurus, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I truly appreciate your love and support. Uh, Taurus, today we will find out what does your person secretly want to confess to you. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading. It will not apply to each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me what does Taurus person want to confess, secretly want to confess to Taurus. Rules can be reversed in this reading, Taurus. Hmm, Taurus, they secretly want to confess to you with the Two of Swords here. They're kind of indecisive whether to offer you this Ace of Pentacles or Ace of Cups here, okay? Offer you love, offer you commitment. And this is a little bit specific. It's not going to apply to all of you. They could also be... Um, they also want to secretly confess to you that they want to have a child or a baby with you. That they want to marry you with Ace of Pentacles here. The Ace of Pentacles could indicate a ring, uh, an engagement ring. Maybe they want to be engaged to you. And if you're pregnant, if somebody is pregnant here, they want to secretly tell you to keep to keep the baby and then let's get married. If you both, both of you are not married. <laughs> it's very specific, okay? Um, <clears throat> But if it's not that with the Ace of Cups and Ace of Pentacles, they just have really good feelings towards you in regards to this new beginning or to renew this relationship with you because Ace is this beginning, maybe starting over for some of you if this is somebody whom you're in separation with currently, okay? But if this is somebody new, I feel like Taurus, hmm. If there are other competition, other people who like you, they... W they're, they're gonna do whatever they can or whatever whatever they can to win this competition okay but again Taurus for a lot of you this may be somebody from your past sneaking their way back into your life okay we've got the world again two of swords here they want to secretly confess to you that you mean the world to them so they will do whatever it takes with the seven of swords here by hook or by crook to have you back or to have you in your life. We've got the Nine of Wands and Two of Cups. Yep, they definitely want to secretly confess to you that they are very attracted to you. They want you. They want you bad. And Two of Cups here, that they do love you. They see you as their soulmate, as their best friend. They see you as somebody they want to have this new beginning with. Or... If it's somebody from your past, they see you as somebody they want to renew your love with, each other's love with. We've got the Page of Cups here and the King of Cups. Interesting. Hmm. For some of you, this may actually be a same gender relationship. Some of you only, okay? But King of Cups and Page of Cups, you could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio can be any sign, okay, I've seen fire here as well, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, fixed signs I see here, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, okay, so Taurus, they want to secretly also confess to you that they, their love has grown, because perhaps it, it started off as a page of cups, which is smaller, and then uh, becoming the king of cups, which is way more, <laughs> from page to king, that's quite a distance, so looks like they could have fallen in love with you, definitely. They want to secretly confess to you that they've fallen in love with you and they see a future with you, okay? Six of Pentacles here. They want to secretly confess to you that they want to give you an equal give and take sort of a relationship. They want to treat you right, okay? They want to have children with you as well, that's what I'm getting. If you have a child before, I don't know, uh, this is a bit weird. Um, something about if you're a single parent, they don't mind. They don't mind. They want to take care of your child as well. If you're a single parent, if not, then they just want to 
get you pregnant and have children with you. We've got the Four of Cups here, or it could go vice versa, it's not gender specific, okay? Four of Cups here, and we've got the Emperor in reverse. They want to secretly also confess to you that you have made them very vulnerable, okay? The Emperor in reverse to me indicates somebody like finally feeling like they're not in charge anymore because now their heart is actually ruling everything. Definitely not their brain. So now their heart is ruling everything and they feel really vulnerable. And we've got the Four of Cups here again. They s mm. Also, they want to secretly confess to you. They may have other options actually, but they don't, they don't like them or that they don't think they're good enough. We've got the Nine of Swords here in reverse and the Devil. Yep. They want to become a better person for you if they've got, you know, nobody's perfect. So um, secretly, they could be working on themselves, trying to fix themselves. Whatever that you don't like about them, maybe for some of you, maybe they were cheating on you in the past. Some of you only, not all of you. If they were a cheater, they don't want to be a cheater anymore. But if if it's not that case, the devil in reverse could just indicate them wanting to become better, okay? Wanting to become a better person for you, a better partner for you. And the moon right here for me indicates I'm having really, really deep emotions for you. I feel like also with the king of cups here, this is somebody whom is not willing to really express how they truly feel about you, how much they really feel about feel for you, how much they love you. So they secretly definitely... <laughs> want to confess to you actually that they love you, they love you a whole lot, they've fallen deeply in love with you and they can't even think straight, they can't even think right they see you as the person that they want to be with long term uh, you either starting over or starting a new relationship with, if this is a new person with the Nine of Swords here in reverse, Taurus hmm. I feel like they can't, <laughs> they can't hold it in anymore. They can't hold it in anymore. It looks like they are about to burst. I feel like they, um, all these feelings that they have for you, they really, really actually want to tell you. But they're not telling you with the two of swords here. For some of you, if this is somebody from your past and both of you are not talking to each other right now, they want to secretly confess to you that they want to come to you. Uh, they want to see you face to face like you can't run away from them. Because the Seven of Swords could indicate like running away or avoiding a bit. That's, that's the energy I'm getting in this spread. They want to be, they want to confess to you that they want to be in your face. Like, uh, like that there's no way for you to run. A little bit like wanting to trap you. Not in a bad way though because they want you for themselves. That's what I'm getting. All right, Taurus, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm gonna leave you with a few videos on the screen right now. These are the videos from my second vlog channel. If you guys are interested, check it out. And also, if you'd like to book me for a private reading, my information is in the, descrip uh, in the description box below. All right, take care, Taurus, bye.